Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the different division platform. Right now, we are doing one such question that came in your NEET examination. This question came on NEET 2021. So, let us see this question first. Question says, a ball of mass 0.15 kg is dropped from the height of 10 meter, strikes the ground and rebounds to the same height. So, that means it must be an elastic collision. Don't you think? So, the ball is dropped from the height of 10 meter and it hits the ground and again it rebounds and it goes to the same height. So that means the speed with which it will gonna hit the ground must be equal to the speed with which it will gonna rebound. Okay, so the rebounding speed must be equal to the, the, the speed with which it will gonna fall down on the ground. Okay, it is falling from the height of 10 meters, so what would be the speed? So V must be equal to root 2 G H, so it must be equal to 2 into 10 into because remind you g has been given to you as 10 meter per second square so we will be taking the value of that only so and the height must be 10 so it is equivalent to 10 root 2 meter per second so this is the speed with which it is gonna hit the ground you need to find out the magnitude of the impulse imparted to the ball okay so the magnitude of the impulse is nothing but change in momentum p final minus p initial Okay, or the or it can be p initial minus p final my also because it, you have, since only you have to find out the magnitude. Okay, so this change in momentum. Suppose upward direction is taken to be positive, so that means downward direction must be taken to be negative. In the upward direction, the momentum is m into v because v is the speed. Okay, in the downward direction, the momentum is m into v. Okay and uh, the upward direction is positive so that means this direction must be negative so p final so m into v is the final velocity minus initial velocity is minus of m into v so it comes out to be 2m into v so this is nothing but 2 into mass mass is 0 0.15 into v what is speed 10 root 2 solving it you will be getting the final answer as 4.2 kg meter per second okay so this is the final answer that you should get okay so the, you need to remember one thing is since it is uh, so since the uh, the speed with which it will gonna hit the ground and as well as the speed with which it will gonna rebound is the same so that means it is an elastic collision so that means there is no loss of energy so that's why it is going to its same height okay rest everything is clear i hope this question is clear to everyone thank you